Welcome to Tutorials with Roaring Records. We've been having a lot of fun today. Um, this is part six of a multi-part presentation. This would be if you want to do a record scratch kind of effect. I'm going to show you kind of how you could do either a slow down or a speed up um, as a record scratch. So we're going to start kind of in the middle of Bruno Mars' uh, grenade and see if we can find a good place that we might want to drop in a record scratch. Why were they open? Ooh. Gave you all I had and you tossed it in the trash. You Ooh. tossed it in the trash. You did. Ooh. To give me all your love is all I ever ask. Cause what you don't understand. Ah, there would be a good uh, place right there. So let's split this. Um, right before he comes in with I'd catch a grenade. So we're just going to highlight our um, move our playhead to where we want to split. We're going to right click, come down here to split and split at playhead. So now I have two separate audio tracks. We can zoom in just a little bit so we can see it better. So I'm going to use for this my fade tool. Seems like an odd choice, but it's the one we want. We're going to then hold the command key on our uh, typing keyboard and have it held down so that we can see the effect. We're going to click and drag and watch this little line come in. Now what that initially does is a volume fade out. Let me show you. Understand so there was a little volume fade out right there, but we want it to be kind of a record scratch. Well, if you right click on that and now switch to slow down, now see it. Don't understand. I catch a grenade. Ah, so there we made a little slow down effect. You can actually, uh, while you have your fade tool selected, you can click on it and drag up or down and it'll change the shape of that uh, slow down depending on what you're looking for. That actually looks like left and right works a little better for that. So here's a different shape uh, slow down. Understand. So you can adjust it. You can also uh, go from the beginning of an audio track and do a little right click again and speed up. So here we go. A speed up into that. So a slow down into a speed up. Don't understand me. What's your grenade for you? Yeah. So pretty neat little thing to do with your fade tool. Um, you can always cross fade stuff with the fade tool and typical volume stuff. But that is a record scratch effect. And I think that is uh, pretty neat. Let's actually go with a different shape. A faster slow down and a faster uh, speed back up. Don't understand what catch a grenade for you. Definitely a lot of places you could use that if you were trying to make a remix or whatever. Hope you found that helpful.